Just when you think it's not possible for Duffy Lion to top herself, she does it again. Peter Hamlin describes the marvel of lion and tiger and butter. Oh my! Make a bit of butter, put biscuits, Betty. Make a bit of butter and we'll have it tonight. Make a bit of butter for biscuits, Betty. Make a bit of butter and we'll have it tonight. Milk the cows in the morning, Betty. Milk them in the morning for butter tonight. Milk the cows in the morning, Betty. Milk them in the morning for butter tonight. Make a bit of butter for... I'm standing just outside the butter cooler in the ag building. Now, just about every day for the last three weeks or so, Duffy Lion has been walking through this door into the 40 degree temperatures inside to work on her famous butter sculptures. And this year, the butter cow has company. Let's go on in and take a look. One of my favorite uh, opportunities at the State Fair is interviewing the great State Fair butter sculptor, Duffy Lyon. How are you, Duffy? I'm fine, thanks. And you? You know, you top yourself every year. Tell us what you've sculpted at the Iowa State Fair for 2005. Well, we carried, get carried away and we did the, uh, an Ayrshire cow and a barn for the Bi Iowa Barn Foundation and Tiger Woods and his friend Eldred. How long have you been doing the butter cow at the Iowa State Fair? This is my 46th year, probably my last. And I've enjoyed them all. I've taken my time, and I can't work rushed. I just can't. Um, and I wanted it to turn out as long as I had anything to do with it. And, and so I took my three weeks like I planned. I've had all kinds of help. Um, it's amazing. <laughs> How does it make you feel when you look out this window here while you're working? You see this huge line of people, little kids, old people, everybody in between, and they're all just staring with wonder at what you've made. I like to see the little kids. The kids have been quite entertained with the tiger and, and even a little girl that seemed quite small. I asked her, did she know who it was? And, and she was real quiet for a minute. And then she said, is it Tiger Woods? And I said, yes, it is. <laughs> Duffy, are you a golfer? No, my dad started me out when I was five, but the club wasn't that interesting. I, I, my mind was on too many things all the time, and I couldn't concentrate. Uh -huh. And I just grew up not being able to, and, and I, I took it in college, and I liked it. And when I hit the ball, it went, <laughs> but I had to hit it first. Okay. I winged it a lot, I whiffed it. <laughs> we have a golf club that Sarah's husband, he, ha he plays golf. And uh, we changed it a little to look more like what we can see at Tigers. Well, what do you think of the uh, golf sculptures here? This is wonderful. I love it. It's a, it's a great change. It's a pretty accurate ti Tiger Woods. She really got the face, I thought. Yeah, she did a wonderful job. Uh -huh. did a great job. Now, uh, you, you play a lot of golf? I play occasionally. Uh -huh. And uh, what would your swing be like with that butter club? Probably better, actually. <laughs> Do you know how to play golf? Yeah. And uh, what do you think about the, the Tiger Woods sculpture? It's pretty good. It's pretty accurate, doesn't it? Yeah. Well, uh, what, would it, what would it be like if you took a, your own swing with a butter golf club? Um, I don't know. It'd probably fall apart. <laughs> what did you think of the golf sculptures That's here? pretty cool. I can't believe they can do all that with butter. That's pretty amazing. Tiger looks pretty accurate. Uh -huh. Yeah. Do you play a lot of golf? A fair amount. I mean, I don't know if what you do call what I do is called playing golf, but I get out there and hit the ball around a little bit. So what would happen to your swing if you had a golf club made entirely of butter? Uh, it would melt. <laughs> yeah, it would be pretty bad. Duffy says she thinks this is the first time a predatory animal has been in the cooler with a butter cow. If Tiger grabs that rope pretty tight, I think. I think she, well, he doesn't seem to be concerned with the cow. Maybe we'll tell people there's an invisible screen between them. <laughs> this is Peter Hamlin with Duffy Lion at the Agriculture Building at the Iowa State Fair with the butter cow. So realistic, you can almost hear her moo. Mm -hmm.